So, you are curious how to use Unity's starter asset, third person controller, with your own custom player avatar. Maybe you are new to Unity or just curious to try out the third person controller. In that case, you are at the right place. I am Cory Code and let's jump right in. First, let's import the starter asset from Unity's asset store. On the asset store, find the starter asset, click open in Unity. In Unity, download and import with the package manager. To learn about how to import an asset, check out my previous video, you will find the link below in the description. A window may pop up as we need to enable the new input system for the standard asset. Click yes and Unity will restart. Now you have the starter asset imported, so let's add it to the scene. Click Tools Starter Assets. You will see three options. First option is Reinstall Dependencies, which is useful if any dependencies are missing. The next two options helps to set up or restore the third person controller. We can select a capsule or armature. I will click armature. It will create two new game objects, player follow camera and player armature. It also adds the main camera to the cinema machine. I will place the avatar onto the ground. When I hit play, I have a working avatar. It can walk, run, and jump. In order to able to push objects, I need to configure the basic rigid body push script. First, I will add the new layer called pushable and assign it for my doorways and all of his children. On the basic rigid body push script, I tick can push and set push layer to pushable, I will leave the strength on default. I click play and now I will able to push through of the doors. Next, I want to limit the jump height and the slope limit. Let's test that. Now I only can jump up the smaller obstacle and climb the more gentle slope only. That's work nice. However, what we really want is use our custom avatar. Open player armature and geometry and disable or remove the armature mesh. Copy your own avatar model into the geometry. Oops, I need to turn on the limbs on my model. The model needs to be humanoid model in a T pose in order to work. On the player armature, replace the avatar with your own avatar. I will adjust the character controllers, colliders, position and size. And then we are ready to test. Okay, looks like we're moving and could break the ball. Jumping is works. Limit is in place. Nicely, we could go up on the slope and on the slope we can't. For more Unity tutorials, please subscribe. See you next time.